Hello and welcome back to Racing JD Place to Space. This is episode 29 and in between the episodes I had a few moments spare. Uh, so I yeah, updated this setup because we needed more and yeah, it's time to hit uh, the productivity modules. Uh, I also yeah, uh yeah, so now feeding modules pretty okay. Still not not enough, but it works. Um, this is not something I designed. Uh, this is I just grabbed off the internet after I realized that it's not very easy. But yeah, this is not tileable and this is this is not uh, not repeatable. But I needed the circuits because uh, yeah I had issues with copper. So I plunked two of these. Uh, so, but these I'm gonna design my own my own thing because yeah, this is not as interesting. Uh, I expanded speed uh, speed modules. As you can see, we now have more. But yeah, that eats a lot of circuits. So I plunked. Uh, yeah, I don't know if I show this. Uh, yeah, this is for a while. This is known. Uh, right, so, also, yeah, uh, I don't remember if I showed in the last episode or I built off camera, but basically this is, yeah, this is working. I researched finally these, uh, but I need to add barrel production, so let's add barrels. Literally don't need more much, so this is gonna be probably more than enough for a while. Um, yeah, uh, added a bit more uh, oil production because there's just not a, too much of it, uh, too little. So I was running out of uh, petroleum, and the plastic was suffering, but now it seems it's okay. Uh, it's Okay, I seem not have didn't connect this. Or, oh, mm -hmm. yeah. So this happened. Found the mistake. Uh, what else? What else did I do during this time? Um, yeah, I cleared out biters quite a bit uh, with the. With the artillery uh, but I also researched this artillery barban barbar barbar god damn it yeah the remote <laughs> bombardment remote so yeah so you know it says and now ah yeah it's still hmm Interesting. It should f show the the range with the remote in hand, which it doesn't. No. Nope. Anyway, yeah, I s have uh, set up quite a few of these. So, because the biters uh, were just yeah, just annoying AF. Yeah, yeah this is just this is sweet. To that, to that. Let's see, oh, I need biter trimming here. I, I can afford it because I have ample production of artillery shells. So just. A few, a, f a few levels of artillery also, yeah, the shooting speed is pretty sweet right now. Okay, so, uh, uh, the only thing is, I need to do this, that, 
Anything else? Yeah, I want this gone. Yeah. Basically, yeah, I just. <laughs> yeah, Fishbone. Well, biters are. It's it's pretty interesting when there are a lot of biters. Like, it it gives a challenge. But yeah, this these settings, it's not really a challenge. But still, when you get to artillery like this, and this remote is like space side. So, if I uh, artillery bombardment remote, yes. Yeah, so this is 2500 uh, science, but there's a smart one <laughs> that's 25k, so uh, that's actually on my research list. Um, actually, how's my research ticking? Let's see, the labs are. Oh! forgot about that well anyway yeah uh, expanded uh, the oil production quite a bit and I completely forgot to set up the timer for the episode but yeah, stopwatch go yeah so yeah about seven minutes of recording so that's okay uh, god damn I hate pipes I need squeak through I usually don't like to play with squeak through, but yeah, it's getting a bit ridiculous. So, yeah, we're actually our right now. We actually need need a lot of this. We do not have enough production of rocket fuel. And I'm completely out of productivity modules. And I have not enough of those two. Not very. <laughs> mm. Yeah, good for you, Fishbone. Yeah, I'm actually my next series is gonna be Crestorio. I wanna, I wanna try. I kind of, I have played Bob's uh, Bob's mods and don't really want to repeat experience on my own. But Crestorio seems less uh, expensive, but still different enough for me to yeah to play it. So. Yeah, uh, where's my, yeah, I need to expand solid fuel production. Uh, let's do that. Because we don't need this anymore. We don't need that. So we can easily just Yeah, just put it like right here. Underground put underground go like that go like that hopefully that's gonna help with the production Okay so mm. Actually, there are gaps, but I think I need a... Yeah, 
yeah, this is a little bit crammed. Oh, this is going full tilt. Though I don't get why it's less items on this side. Everyone's full on light wood. Ah, I guess I forgot this. Stupidity squared. Uh, yeah, I learned to love this. Max rate calculator is awesome. It's just, uh, this is something I'm gonna always add to every playthrough now because this makes life way easier. So we are producing 45, exactly a blue belt. Well, I would say it was planned, but it wasn't. <laughs> and we are consuming 30. And 15 go to the smelting area. Or at least it should. So this is quite well. Okay. So hopefully, um, yeah, obviously it's gonna be all picked up, but at least our rate, production rate is good now. So we are producing how many? Yeah, three, three a second. Yeah, Yo, that's 180 a minute. That means we can launch a rocket every 7-8 minutes. A rocket is gonna go up. Um, yeah, that sounds about right. That should be a good pace. So let's go connect back my science, which I rudely interrupted. Yeah, I managed to fuck this up and it was going to the wrong side of the belt so let's connect let's connect uh, almost burned through my backlog uh, sciences definitely are not gonna be sustainable at the speed I'm doing it right now uh, with this base but yeah this is just to research parts of it and then just do so something else Okay, let's balance that. Yep, that's waiting on rocket fuel. It's requesting 400. Get, doesn't get as much. Okay, anyway. Uh, so, uh, I have extended power. And to, but we are... I'm kind of not really in a mood right now to expand rail network and start uh, getting all the all the space and kill biters, and we do need to set up the mining of uranium gas. And I'm gonna uh, so I'm gonna dedicate this episode and probably next episode to this expanding uh, adding uranium and uh, uranium processing, building all the things for uh, for the reactor and we gonna make a reactor because I need I need more power. I want to start uh, I want them to get do some uh, exploration and and yeah then start building uh, from ground up like uh, smelting which is gonna be definitely beaconed and all that jazz. So yeah, we're gonna go into expansion mode and supplement our base with uh, new builds, you know, more resources so we can build better, uh, faster and better. I need this, I have a lot of these. 
uh, I'm gonna need some additional undergrounds. I don't think I'm gonna need splitters. And I have bites are killing things. Okay, did this got built? Yep, we got. Let's take our remote. And yeah, I believe I didn't. Yeah, yeah. There is a timeout, so you can't just leave it for a long time. Okay, let's kill these buggers. And I want to get rid of these buggers too. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I think that's enough art. Well, honestly, let's do this. Because, yeah, the by hand remote. Uh, Artillery targeting remote has way bigger range than the automatic one. Yeah, we can we can kill a lot of stuff. So I'm gonna use that. Sadly, for some reason this doesn't trigger. So yeah, biters die. And what? I also want to add quite a few. Mm. Yeah, I, I I automated the production of the artillery turrets, so there should be a few more built. <coughs> yep, There's, there are enough bots to do that. Let's grab a one of these. So yeah. So this is this. Biters go away. Okay. There are my yep. done. Yeah, biters, please go. Go and die to the... To my laser walls. Ah. Yep, it seems I need to do more biter clearing. Let's do that. Now this is this is awesome. Boom. <laughs> yeah, when you have lots of turrets, if you see in JD Place uh, how he does it, he made a a big buffer train. So he literally like this, he covers in a single shot almost. He has that many wagons, like ten over ten thousand shells in it so yeah he's yeah it's like a single volley every single biter dead okay so this should help me Needed to build this probably here, like this, so I can repeat it as a longest row. Yeah. 
Predators, leave me alone, please. Okay, this needs to go like that. Okay, let's do some biter clearing. Okay, everybody's dead. Yeah, I need to. I need to make walls here. Let's do that. Let's put on this. Yeah, yeah, make some. Yeah, die, 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 you bastard. Okay, done. So, let's do that. Let's do that. Let's run the power poles to the base. Yeah, they're already chewing it on it. This one, okay, like this, put here, one here, one here, one here, here, okay, this should work for a while, let's finish our outpost. This uh, we are no, we are going to use the construction planner. Okay, that works. I'm gonna add later the missing pieces. Right now, let's do this. Yeah, that covered everything this let's do that obviously remove these okay so this seems to be covering everything let's grab the smaller one again and stick it uh, basically like this not the most efficient one but it works let's make a balancer no, balancer should have that that So that's that. Now, where uh, probably we should do the production and reactor here because there is space for it. Because there's not really any space anywhere else to do it. So, yeah, that's probably gonna be the proper, proper thing to do. Okay, let's connect power. Finish the wall. I mean defenses. Yeah, let's just put some in here. I'm gonna then move them, but yeah, for now that's plenty. Let's eat that. Uh, we want to remove trees here. That's for sure. So, trains. How many? Oh, oh, oh. No, we're not gonna do that. Not anymore. 
и remove all the coal. So how many do we have? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I have exactly eight planes. But yeah, uh, these are big ones, and I think I, oh no, I didn't remove these. So it, yeah, I think this is this is gonna be good enough for for the uranium. That should be okay. to connect pipes there same deal connect like that that this run yep and I'm out of belt uh, so what do we need more? We we gonna need a train. Train trucks we have. You now what? Let's do this. Let's place a roboport here, and let's just extend the network. That's gonna be way way easier. To deal with. Here, uh, robot port here, that, and just run across like this. those why are only two express belts mm. hmm. no. weird okay let's run back uh, yeah those boats decided to go that route not very smart of them uh, but um, Let's actually do this. Can I stick? A few of these all over the place and just connect them with power poles. So bots can have like a charging highway or something like that so we want our probably our big station well we want it exactly like this let's run here this is gonna be the direction of travel so the train station needs to be yeah let's give it some space it's ain't perfect but it should be good enough Uh, actually, no. Oopsie, I need to do it like this and flip it around. Yeah, 
this works. Uh, now let's go around, go there, 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 and there, and deconstruct these walls. As we don't need them anymore. But also, let's add a few redundant power poles because it's always a good idea. Okay, do are we missing something? No, we do we do not. Uh, we are missing power here. Yeah, because everything's flying. Okay. Uh, do we have... Yeah, I think we should have... So we need... One fluid wagon. We need... Regular wagons. Yeah, we're gonna have to get those here. So eight of those, two locomotives, and we want yeah, uh, six of these, six nuclear fuel. So that should be traveling. Okay. Covered that should be in route. Yeah, let's call it uh, Ukraine new post one. It's done. Yeah, so it's about an episode. So in the next episode, we're gonna continue setting up uh, this mine, we're gonna finish it and start building uh, a nuclear reactor. So thank you for watching and see you in the next episode. Bye-bye.